while back while we were up north, I promised that I would uh, give you a final look, see at the finished product of the art project, the art quilt based on a hibiscus that grows right outside our house here in Florida. Okay, this is pretty cool. There's the flower based on an actual photograph. Notice the cute little creatures on here, a butterfly and a bee, and here's a nice ladybug. And there are some other projects in progress. Some of these were completed up north. And these are fish. And these are put together with just little rectangles. And you do all the shading based on different colorations and stuff. And here's a little more tropical looking one, but notice how the top is, if you kind of squint your eyes, you can sort of notice the, the gradation of shading that would occur with realistic lighting. And here's one in progress. And right now it's a big mess. You can see all the little blocks of stuff that are here. Yeah. And uh, that just makes it very interesting in piecing together. So here's the work zone where you cut out all the little parts and then you try to fit it together based on what makes good sense in terms of coloration and gradation of shading. Am I basically getting this correct? Yes, they're called little strips and there's sticky stuff on the back of them that I ironed on. So they, they are sticky and you can put them down and there they are. Now, are you going to eventually keep... run those through a sewing machine and glue them down with thread or just... Uh... Once I get it the way I want it, I will iron it and it will all be fused. And these would be wall hangers, right? I think, yeah. It's not big enough for a quilt. So, um, yeah, I'll peel it off this paper, this Teflon, and put it on a piece of fabric like I did down there. And then sew it like crazy <laughs> to make sure it's really on there. Okay, after these, what's the big next one? Or you, just, you don't think that far ahead? I don't know yet. Yeah, sorry. <laughs> okay. So there you have it. More art from the Quilt Lab. Thanks for being with us. Good night, everybody.